um, <clears throat> find a way to heal cancer, right? Yeah. And now there's like donations out there where, where, where um, they're saying, oh, let's fight the cancer. Let's donate money. See? To me, I like, like, like basically, like the Wilhelm Reich, he was basically researching remedies and healing, ways of healing that came from the East. Yeah. And then he was able to like explain that in Western terms and turn it into science and basically like transform the entire medical industry. But just mm -hmm. like the Tesla thing, it's not profitable. So then they, they basically burned his teachings and pretty much like killed him off or whatever. So then it remains the way that it is so then they can keep profiting. Like, yeah. basically, an example is something that is clear right now, like, in our family, like, like, some of our kids have, like, um, when they get sick, they have, like, breathing problems, you know, and we'd have to go to the doctor, and then they'll put them, like, med they'll put them on medication, and they'll put them on this, like, this breathing device, right? Yeah. And, and all this stuff costs a lot of money. It's, like, a, a boatload of money, right? Mm -hmm. So then, um, we were using that. Like every time they get sick, we use that. But then recently, Jenny started rubbing like woodlock in their chest. Mm -hmm. And this woodlock is really cheap, right? And it comes from Hong Kong. And then it okay. basically opens up their airways. And then it's even more effective than what the Western science, the Western medicine was giving us. Do you know what I'm saying? Like that Western stuff, that, that machine and all that, that, that prescription stuff, hundreds of dollars the woodlock less than 20 bucks you know what i'm saying so basically like western medicine is more like hey you know um take all these medications like if you're depressed okay take this medication hundreds exactly. of a few hundred dollars in the east it's more like you got to learn to meditate when you learn to meditate then the, then the depression will go away and that, there's no money involved right there really you know what I'm saying? Except for the teachings of how to meditate, but like, also like acupuncture is more like a natural healing opposed to like surgery or something like that, which yeah. costs like thousands of dollars. Mm -hmm. And then like, um, they also use like a lot of teas and herbs, you know, like in the East. But here, yeah. it's all about just injecting you with a bunch of medicine, you know? So, yeah, they're not going to save you, man. So, they're just making you dependent on you on them pretty much they're not trying to heal you at all yeah at least i don't think so so there's that all that going on and um there, there's some a lot of corruption all over not just you know you, you hear me talking about the corruption in the martial arts i was in the police there's a lot of corruption in the police and yeah they're like, criminals themselves yeah uh, like i don't know if you heard of eddie griffin right the comedian yeah um, there's a, he has a channel called Eddie Griffin News and he was, he was, um, showing how the police are so corrupted to the point that they put on, they put, um, they make, they made a dog like chewing on the black person, like eating the black person in, in his own car, even when his hand was all, all up like that, you know, he was surrendering, but the police just kill him with the dog. So fucked up the police is, man. Yes, yeah, so I mean, there's that, and then the medical is is really uh corrupted too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like literally they can heal somebody with there's a there's a healing method for like under twenty bucks, but then they tell them to take like a twenty thousand dollars surgery instead. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like there's a lot of corruption out there, like everywhere. You know, but you can't say that all doctors are corrupted. You can't say all police officers are corrupted. But it's just a lot of corruption in this world in general. You know what I'm saying? And, um, yeah. yeah. As far as what happened to you, I definitely believe that happened, So, Like, the way they wrongfully terminated you. I definitely believe that happens. Oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, th this is the way that I am, man. I mean, it's like, I stand up against corruption, like, anywhere I go. 
oh. to the point where it's like I don't fit in anywhere almost. It's like, it's like I'm a, I'm a police officer, but then I'm talking shit about the police. Like people are like, why are you talking shit about your own thing? But that's, what, that's, that's how you expose corruption. Like you got to be a part of it to understand it. Yeah. Like I practice martial arts, but I talk shit about martial artists. Why am I doing that? Well, because in order to, to truly criticize martial artists, you got to be a part of that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's like a black person talking trash about bl other black people. Well, I mean, it's like you, you understand it more because you're in there. You know what I'm saying? It's like, so people will be like, oh, you know, he's a hypocrite, whatever the case may be. It's more like, no, you know, I have life experiences and I'm exposing the corruption that I see in whatever I experience. Mm -hmm. You know, so it's like, even though it's a good paying job, you know, I, I, I see that I was not meant to be a police officer. I was meant to do what I'm doing right now. Yeah. You know, it's like. Yeah, it's like you're not even meant to be in a martial arts either, right? Yeah. Since the martial is so corrupted. I guess that's how I am too, you know. All I'm really doing with the martial art is really, like, just a way to exercise, really. I guess all I'm meant to be is just exercising. But really, the techniques in the martial arts is, is just in a way, 